had worked in very early stage companies for about 15 years, both founding some and working on other people's ventures. And in 2009, I had been working on a lot of early stage companies and ideas. And um, a friend of mine said, you, you should really start angel investing. Like the only way to really become an investor is to start doing it. And that really rang true to me because that's what entrepreneurs do. Like you just gotta get up and do it. It's not, there's no other solution than to kind of put your money where your mouth is and start backing people and working with them and learn how to be really good at it. So that's what I started doing. I raised a fund with Techstars, which is a very early stage accelerator here in Boston. And again, just got so much um, exposure to companies and really started kind of learning the trade of venture capital. There are a couple ways in which I can be helpful to students. One is work anyone who's working on a venture and wants help around making progress. And the second is if people are thinking about venture as a career path, I can probably help them think through that. I'm very good at taking kind of early stage ideas and helping people figure out kind of how to make progress, which is the key to entrepreneurship. You know, what's the right progress to make? How do you make it quickly and with the right amount of capital for your idea? So some ideas are giant billion dollar ideas and should raise a lot of money. And that's how you go fast and some are not. I think I can be helpful to people who are thinking that they want venture to be their career, but I, I will caveat that by saying that I think most people should be entrepreneurs first and that I think that's the best way to become an investor is to kind of wear your, you know, learn from practicing.